Hello, my name is Erin and I'm the manager of Curation and Collections here at the Bateman Foundation Gallery of Nature. This month, we asked you if you had any questions for Robert Bateman. We chose the paintings, you asked the questions, here are Robert's answers. The first painting we're looking at today is Canada Geese Nesting. Out of all the questions we received, here are some of Robert's answers. Cheryl Wright asked, what color did you paint the canvas first? Robert answered, I can't remember. Sometimes it was simply the white gesso, but often I started on a gray background made with mostly white, plus some Payne's gray and raw umber, acrylic of course. I'm usually first drawn to the wildlife. About 10% of the time, it could be the landscape. Question number two, how was Robert able to get that close to the geese? His response, it happened that this pair were very tame, partly because we fed them. We lived on the Aramosa River in Guelph, Ontario. A story I tell on this topic. I am driving along the highway, enjoying perhaps fall colors. Suddenly, a red-tailed hawk appears out of nowhere and does a pirouette over the highway. My heart does a leap. It is that little leap that is important. David Burns asked, do you remember if there was a particular reason why Canada Geese Nesting was selected to be your first print? Robert answered, it was selected by the publisher to be made into a print because the subject matter would be popular and easy to sell. It is pointless to make prints that are unlikely to sell, a waste of money and material. The same does not apply to originals. Presumably, the artist does the painting for him or herself. Selling is secondary. <laughs> 